In this video, I'll show you different ways you can bridge funds to Solana with minimal gas fees. And at the end, I'll show you some of the popular Solana dApps to help you start exploring this fast growing ecosystem. Welcome back to RankFi, where we explore crypto together. So the prerequisites you need are one, a phantom wallet and a couple dollars worth of Solana to pay for gas fees. So you're going to need a wallet and this is the one I use. So we're going to use this in the video. You can go to phantom.app and install it on your mobile app or as a Chrome extension. So Phantom is one of the most popular Solana wallets. It has over 3 million downloads and it's like MetaMask for Solana. Once you have it set up, the user interface looks something like this. And now you have to deposit some Solana to pay for transactions on the network. Now Solana is very cheap when it comes to gas fees. So you only need a couple dollars worth. It'll last you a very long time. And that brings us to step two. How do we deposit funds into the wallet? So you have two options. You can send money from a centralized exchange, Coinbase, Binance, things of that nature, or you can use a bridge to send money from different blockchains. So if you're using option number one, sending from a crypto exchange, you would just take this wallet address, paste that into Coinbase or wherever you're sending from and transfer funds to your wallet. Make sure you transfer Solana so you have gas fees. That's option one. Let's move into option number two, bridging from other blockchains. So Solana has various bridges where you can send money from Ethereum, Binance Chain, Arbitrum, Optimism, and all the popular blockchains. If you have money on any of those, you can transfer it to Solana with bridges, which will all be linked in the description. So you can use myon.finance, core.allbridge.io, this is my favorite one and portalbridge.com. These are some of the most popular ones. I'll show you how to use core.allbridge.io. Again, these are linked in the description. You're going to connect your wallet in the top right corner. So MetaMask, whatever. So I have a MetaMask. I'm going to enter my password here. And this bridge lets you send funds from Arbitrum, Avalanche, BNB Chain, Ethereum, Polygon, and Tron. Now, if you want to do it for as minimal gas fees, I would avoid using Ethereum because Ethereum has higher gas fees. Any of these other chains will be very cheap. And if we look at um, Mayan Finance, for example, they only have five networks here and Portal Bridge has the most if you want the most blockchains, just so you know. But let's say I have $22 here on Arbitrum, so I would do that. Let's say I wanna send that $15 worth. Then you click this button here, connect wallet, and we're gonna connect our Phantom wallet, which we just installed. There we go, now it has my address. We can see all the fees near the bottom here. And then just click send. A notification will pop up for the gas fees. Then I can click confirm if everything looks good. As you can see, that was only like 70 cents or so. And now it's sending USDC to Solana. This will take 10 to 15 minutes. So you can just wait and then the funds will arrive. And it really is that simple. If you have any questions, just leave a comment down below. Now let's look at how you can use the Solana ecosystem. Here are six tools that will be helpful for you when going through this ecosystem. Number one, jupe.ag. Now, if you want to swap tokens on Solana, Jupiter Exchange will look at prices across all the DEXs and give you the best rates. So you can just go here whenever you want to swap tokens and you will get the best rates. Number two, if you're trying to claim Solana airdrop, go watch my previous video here where I show you how to get 18 potential Solana airdrops that show you a lot of protocols that don't have token yet that you can start using today. Tool number three, Drift protocol. Now, if you want a DEX to go long or short on different Solana tokens with leverage, Drift is one of the leading DEXs, perp DEXs on Solana. And they're adding more tokens regularly, as you can see on the left-hand side of the screen here. And you can go up to 20X leverage, obviously be safe. If you want to use Drift, make sure to use my link in the description to get the best discount on your trading fees. Tool number four, we have birdeye.so. On here, you can get better charts for new Solana tokens. You can do research, find new tokens, and even track whale wallets and stuff like that. As you can see, tons of statistics here if you want to explore Solana. Tool number five, we have Jito Network. Now you might've heard of this one because of their very recent airdrop, but if you wanna stake your Solana to earn up to 6.96% APY, you can go to this website, stake your Solana, and you will receive the liquid staking token, Jito Soul, and you'll start earning APY on your Solana. And tool number six, we have DeFi Llama. Now, if you want some just general statistics on the Solana network, such as the total value locked, or just find new protocols that are growing in TVL on Solana, you can use DeFi Llama. If we scroll down here, we can see a bunch of protocols, see how much money is locked, see the percent change, and it's a very useful tool to find new projects and just get general statistics. Drop a like if you found this video helpful and leave a comment if you have any questions, I'll try to answer them. See you in the next video.